What we've seen in this particular edition of our London Business Survey is a real rebound in business confidence and sentiment compared to the very low levels that we saw at the end of last year. When we did this survey with KPMG in December, what we saw is that only about 13% of businesses felt optimistic about the prospects for the economy over the first six months of 2012. Actually, now what we see is a real pickup in confidence about both the economy and about individual business prospects. So about half of the businesses that responded said that they expect their own business prospects to improve over the next six months. But what they also told us is that the Eurozone has shot right back up to the top of business concerns that is dominating the outlook for the next six months. And we need a real resolution to this crisis because at the moment it's weighing on plans to invest in things like IT and also in terms of hiring more people. In this particular survey, businesses told us that London is still a good place to do business. About 86% actually say that London is a good or very good place to do business. And almost 90% said that they still see their businesses being here in five years' time. So there are some really positive findings for London there compared to other European and global cities. In particular, respondents noticed, noted the access to global markets, proximity to customers and clients, and the really wide skills pool available in London as really key benefits of being here. But they did also note some key weaknesses that continue to weigh down on the attractiveness of the capital. And in particular, those were the relatively high operating costs, the tax environment, and the need for continued improvements to our transport infrastructure. Transport is always an issue that's of concern to businesses when they're determining whether London is a good place in which to operate. So we always ask them what they think of the transport network. In this particular survey, about 80% said that the transport network was either staying the same or improving, which is a really positive finding. Um, of that, the tube was the best performing part of the network, and about 42% of businesses said that they see improvements in the tube, and one can speculate that that's perhaps a result of the tube upgrade investment programme now starting to pay dividends in terms of customer experience. However, the roads continue to be a black spot in the um, transport network in London, and we really do need to see improvements there. We asked businesses for their top five solutions to improving the transport system in London and three of the top five solutions related to aviation capacity and I think that what this tells us is that this is a very important issue for businesses operating in London and that we need more capacity in London and the South East and we need that capacity and decisions about that capacity to be made quickly.